after five years ago, after a very difficult divorce, uh, I started working with Sinlar Loan Mortgaging Company to offer me a loan modification. I I had a hundred thousand dollars worth of equity in the house, and I only owed fifty thousand um, dollars. Sinlar refused to work with me. They claimed they would not give me the loan modification because the ex-husband would not sign it. I spent five years with different organizations, Hank Johnson, Office of Currency, Legal Aid, all of them stating that I could afford the house if I received a loan modification. They absolutely refused. In May of last year, they decided, I think strategically, to foreclose on the deed of the first owner. There's no way I can stop a foreclosure in the wrong name. So this afternoon, we are helping Ms. Furman, who is a member of Occupier Homes Atlanta, to take back the house she was wrongfully foreclosed on and evicted from uh, about a month ago. Today, we are going to just walk back in to Ms. Furman's home. She's going to move back in. Uh, and we are immediately going to reach out to Sinlar uh, FSB executives, try to talk to them and get them to the table so we can discuss you know, what happened and uh, a resolution that will keep Ms. Furman in her home. There's a new kind of slavery. It's called mortgage ba mortgagers, banks, and mortgage servicing companies. I have been enslaved by Sinlar Mortgage for five years. Today is the end of that slavery. I have been as shrewd as a snake and as gentle as a dove. I have done nothing wrong except that trust that Sinlar will be professional and fair. What do I do? Just turn the knob. They stole my house. Stole it and you took it back. Forwarded to an automated voice Ooh. messaging system. Greg Turnquist. It's not available. At the tone, please record your message. Mr. Turnquist, uh, my name is Joe Beasley. You can uh, look me up on Google, such uh, such engine. Joe Beasley, <coughs> Occupy Atlanta. I want to let you know that we've repossessed a property at 1420 Stone Lee. Hill Road in Lithonia, Georgia, that's owned by Miss Tony Furman. I appreciate it very much if you give me a call. It's a fact that people are more important than houses. Now, if you've taken this, this one, every other house in this community is going to be devalued. So I expect to get a call from you. My advice is to fight. Don't give up. Just fight. You deserve your dignity. You deserve your home.